off friggin' heights, boys. I don't know why I do this to myself every friggin' single friggin' day. I don't have time. I don't have time to friggin' wipe my own ass, boys, and I'm friggin' off on another Kijiji adventure. Got the friggin' trailer word on, friggin'. Oh my goodness. And, uh, it's another just rustier as frig Dodge we're going to look at. For just absolutely thousands of dollars. Eh? Un friggin' believable. But, oh, and it's three hours, 40 minutes away. So we're just leaving now. Well, we left two minutes ago. We'll be there at 2.34. Arrival time is 2.34 in the afterwards. So hopefully the next three and a half hours goes definitely smoother as frig. And uh, the trammy doesn't just puke itself. And we'll go see about uh, picking up another rig. Eh? Freaking rights we will. Anyways, we'll bounce us the advance here, and uh, when we get there, we'll just Kijiji son of a bitch rip this guy off something terrible. But it's probably gonna be the other way around. No mistake. Don't shift. No, no. Don't. Sh oh, no. Almost. Come on. Oh, just hanging up. Just hanging up. I'll have to let off. Watch let off and this and that and then it'll shift because that's totally how how that's supposed to work man for sure without a doubt but anyways looks like somebody's getting ready to bail they uh, just had to yank her over the door just come flying open but he must have to just sick uh, he's just gonna friggin bomb it all the undercurrent on my truck. Holy suffer. I gotta get some damn rusty. Kind of a gloomy day today. Hopefully the, uh, the weather's copacetic when we get there. Son of a bitch, still got one, two, three hours left on our trip. Just hammer down something terrible. Jeep is just taking me through every friggin' town. Going to McSigger, it's not terrible. It's a nice nice day for a drive I guess but I've uh, never been through any of these little towns. No go, go, you know what I mean? Look at this guy. How you doing? Playing trap there, little how you doing? Goodness gracious. Just passed a sled friggin' cross and sign and we got a friggin' horse drawn McSigurders. Yeah, we aren't in with anymore. Friggin' windy up here boys. Machines, sons of bitches. Look at this guy's load. It's got like 10 inch trailer tires. Friggin' just an absolute heap of the scrap metals. Oh my goodness. You got a shot at the side of it. Pretty impressive. Eh? Oh my goodness gracious. Brake lights are working just friggin' splendid. Hey? Eh? Friggin' right there. Oh yeah, what do we got here? All type of wood and stuff and friggin' different things. Oh, let's get a shot. Oh yeah. Friggin' Doss a pony. Looks like he bedlinered the truck. Looks like it's felt. Okay. Ooh. Looks like it's made of felt. Take her to the scrapyard, boys. All of a sudden we're in some sort of a magical winter's wonderland. This is just terrific. Here we'll be laying on the ground in the friggin' mud and snow and slush and sleet. Hopefully it's just the downpour of the McSigurd factor of the frozen valve in, uh, I don't even know where we're going. The Sago Beach or some horse shit. Any words? Another half a words to go. Almost thirds. Holy shit, dirty shit stainer. How you doing? I've never been here to be fair. I know a smelly mummy uh, from around these parts. Man, my friggin' earring is dicked. My whole head is just collapsing in on itself. This must be a lower altitude, something terrible. Holy. Wow. Lions. Continue on to Main Street. I'm trying. Get past simmer. Frick's sakes, I 
could have dropped off the Shitsifica and saved myself a trip. Or at least not friggin' uh, told all the swords on empty trailers. Hey, eh? Oh well. Saga 500 go karts. I like it. Right on. <laughs> no. Right on. Sunroof DVD player in the back. She leaks terrible. Oh. Fist bumps. I still went through. I got two metal plates in there. It isn't the best. A little arthritic. No, you find that your stays clean in your truck, eh? Just gassing me out here. You don't like the smoke? <laughs> Sorry about that. Not overly. <coughs> thing is, I don't know, they've got it geared right or something or another, but it's really, uh, it's actually really good. On the fuel. <coughs> Shit, you've got the checker plate uh, tan on cover, right? it'd be worth fixing. What's that? Says I was hoping it'd be worth fixing. But the frame's fucking rotten too. Well, I don't think the frame's rotten on it. It's just surface fucking water and shit. Yeah. You know when they're just talking and talking and talking and talking and talking and they're full of shit.
Oh, Frank's not riding. This is a service rest. That's my buddy. Good for you, but fuck it, I'm driving one of these trucks, bro. My truck was a surface rust too. You put up on the hoist, it bends in half. Sheesh. Right, better off anyways. How oh, the fuck you let a truck rot so much? 153,000 kilometers. And the oil changed too. Holy fucking shit. Oh, every truck I was going say, what? No, it's not good. The oil's just completely black as fuck. Told me that the oil pan shows signs of rust. Well, my oil pan shows signs of rust, but then I get here, all the oil pan leaks do, so I just add oil. Don't ever change it, just keep adding. Awesome. Thanks for, uh, thanks for telling me when I got here. Holy suffering, you can't just drive that down the road. You'd put that in a trailer, you son of a bitch. Fuck a matter for yourself, probably. Oh, boy. Seems like everybody's got a Cummins for sales are goof. Did I, did I mention that? Oh, how sonoric. How sonoric. Garbage truck blocking view of terrible sonoric sonoric. Kind of saw this by it. Okay, the fucking canary park line. It is. Yeah, you can feel the friggin' trammy slip in that friggin' truck too, eh, friggin'? Trammy slip in every single panel, like he forgot to tell me, he said, Oh, it just needs rockers. Just needs rockers, bud. Friggin', all the box is good. It's just starting to show. No, that's not starting to show, bud. It's rotten. <laughs> Holy shit. Uh, you should be allowed to punch people in their fucking face. Even the seat. He took a picture of the seat with the seat cover off it, but at an angle to which the rip didn't show. First, this is a great big rip. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's the only other thing. Yeah, the only other. It's like, other than that, you said the fucking interior was mint. Kajiji it again, eh? Son of a bitch. Oh, well. Oh, we got all type of days to burn. For friggin' snow comes anywhere. It's holy shit. But, Edwards, boys. Stove pipe. What? Ears are popping again, so I'm terrible. And it looks like we found the ski slopes. Oh my goodness. Terrible much funds. Snapped friggin' legs happens over there. Oh, here's a freaking bull stick town, eh? Heard many a story about dirty old Mintus. I did. We'll be home for an hour and eleven. Son of a bitch. Just darker as frig. Mark! Well, I know it could have been worse. Could have friggin' ended upside down in their celery sticks, I suppose. But uh, yeah, I learned something today, boys. Quit, uh, quit, quit mega cabs. Make up no good. Friggin' uh, a lot of schmancy and no pantsy, if you know what I'm saying. Yeah, I think I decided I'm uh, I'm after a six-speed. After same truck like Rusty, only long box, dually or single rear wheel, either or. But uh, got to have a six-speed. I quit automatic transmission. I paid thirty-five hundred dollar for a transmission. It doesn't even last a year. Now these fucking guys are like beacon off about. They need me to bring the invoice and blah, blah, blah. It's like you wrote a bunch of stuff down on a piece of paper. It wasn't an invoice. The fuck you talking about? It was a billet shaft and drum and the friggin' thicker second gear belt thing. Friggin' all the friggin' Bogart and son of a bitch frazzlers in the stovepiper. Bet you if we tore into it, it ain't got none of that. Eh? That'll be great. So we'll get another truck and then when we're... Done marmaduking with the 83, which will, at this rate will be never. I don't know. I don't know what's happened, but and then we got to do some roofing here soon. We got uh, got a lot of stuff to do, boys. Try my best, I'm spreading myself thin here. I'm hoping that the roofing thing will will catch on, and we'll be able to 
We'll be able to hire a monkey full time inward, and then inward will will grow, and everybody will benefit. Hey, eh? you just gotta hang on just a fucking few seconds. It'll be fucking awesome. And either way, I mean, if the roofing thing doesn't go through, we'll just quit that horse shit, and we'll, you know, we'll stagger back into our regularly scheduled stovepipe. But I'm still trying to trying to drag her out for a few more minutes. So my apologies and. Uh, also trying to make the Patreons happy and uh, big big sale at uh, humpagoat.com eh? up to 25% off different types of the merch you can get hats and sweaters and shirts and decals and nonsense and horse shit it's fucking awesome and I'm willing to give 25% of my pesos back to you as an appreciatory valve eh? can you imagine that all this all this is going to happen before Christmas too by the way but anyways, boys, let me know what you think about uh, crew cab, six speed, long box, dually, way much more better for the friggin' uh, gear selection capabilities. And uh, yeah, it'll be like Big Rig Trucker Pug 1. Hey, figure five chat like button if you missed a couple of bitches for the week, but anyways, boys, beg my pardon, which is here in order to put on the Don't the watchers get you.